guys and welcome to my channel DZ Software. So today we are going to talk how you can convert in your website into an Android app with just one click. So there are a lot of reasons to convert in your website into an Android app and also you can start monetizing from your Android app and get more visitors and customers to your website from your app that's great right but if you go and search to many ways how you can do that so probably you go to google and you search for websites who are giving you these services like this website it's called app my site but the problem of these websites who are giving you these services it's not giving you the full access and control for your source code so you cannot make the changement as you wish exactly who matching with your business idea so in that case you need to build your one app from scratch and you are not a programmer or you don't have any experience or probably that's very really expensive for you if you go hire uh, a freelancer so today we're giving you the solution it's very simple all you have to do we making ready source code for you and all you need to do is very simple and basic changements about it on it so first of all let's show you a quick demonstration about the app how it's working so let's run the app and when the app is going to start it it's going to give me us a beautiful splash screen with logo and animation in few seconds is going to access in our website after the splash screen it's shown right so our website it's right here and he's working fine so we can scroll down and we can see our website work perfectly in the bottom we can see also we have a banner ad so we can monetize it from our app so this is a quick demonstration about the app how it look like on the device so first of all you need to open the search code and change your package name and after you change your package name you go scroll down to change your splash screen design you go to layout layout is going to be closing folder like this and you have to open it and you have to go to activity splash you click on it dot xml you click on it and it's going to open you this section right here with this code okay so if you want to change the background color you don't want the color be white you can change it very easy all you have to do is go to relative layout and you go to android background color and after this you type the name of the color that you wish so to change the animation you go to this section and change it but before that how you can get this animation it's very simple and very easy all you have to do go to Google you type on the search Lottie Plotter and you go to this website you open it then he's going to open for you this beautiful website right here and you have to sign up first after that you go and search for any kind of animation who matching with your business idea app so let's say for example you like this animation you can click on it and it's going to open for you this animation you go to download you click on it and you go to Lottie JSON you click on it and you download the file json file so after you download it you go back to your source code 
and you copy your JSON file. Then you go to the save bar right here and you go to raw folder. You search for raw folder, you open it and you paste it right here. You paste your JSON file right here. After you paste in your JSON file right here, you go back to activity splash.xml and you go to this section, Lottie animation. Then you go to app Lottie row. And after this, you change the name of your animation you give it to your JSON file. So you have to change the name of your JSON file. Give it any name that's matching. But keep it simple and easy and uh, the name doesn't have characters or the numbers. So keep in mind that you need to change the name after he's downloaded as a JSON file. Change the name and don't give it uh, characters or numbers, just a simple name like this. For example, this hello, give it hello here. Any kind of the name that you want. So after you change, you give it the name, like for example, we have a car here, we type car, you can see the animation change. If we type again, hi, it changed the animation, but the animation we have it here, JSON files. So we change it again to, hello, let's go back to our first animation really easy right and we scroll down a little bit if we want to change our logo right here we go to this section image view but before we can change it here we need to copy our logo then we go to sidebar and we look for drawable file so the file is will be Close it like that, we need to open it and we passed it our logo right here. After we passed it, we go back to image view section and we go all in the bottom and our source code drawable. After drawable, we change the name of our logo name file. So we give it the name of our logo name image okay the name inside your logo image give it to your logo image you change it right here and when you change it it will be shown right here so you can change the design as you wish but we're keeping the design pretty simple very easy and very basic so everybody uh, even if he is beginner don't have any experience with uh, uh, programmation and stuff like that so he can uh, simply change the design and get beautiful splash screen after you change all that so you're changing your splash screen you go to my activity you go to Java you open it you open your package name you have to change your package name keep in mind that and you go to my activity open your mine activity and after you open your mine activity you scroll down a little bit and you get this section so we can read here in this section edit your website link so my web view loud URL you give your website link right here you passed your website link right here with HTTPS okay make sure your website you have HTTPS and your website name after you passed your website name you are ready to go but you guys if you want to start monetizing for your from your app before uh, change your app I mean uh, convert your website into an Android app so when you upload in the app to Play Store and people who start using your app you start monetizing from it by showing the ads uh, 
uh, from Google Ads or Uploven or whatever company it is inside your app so you start monetizing you need to change a couple steps first so here we link it uh, Uploven but if you want to change it and edit AdMob you can do that but it go back to you so inside the app we edit Uploven so how how we can change the uploading uh, code so we can uh, start monetizing you don't change anything everything is ready for you all you have to change is your uh, ID banner ID so if you scroll down a little bit right here you can see prove void banner ID prove it wide uh, banner ID you go to add view max view and you go to this section and you edit your banner ID right here how you can get your banner ID you simply guys go to Google you upload in go to upload in you create an account in upload in you can you can see on the, on YouTube there are a lot of the videos explain how upload in work it's a company like AdMob and it's similar like AdMob. You can edit AdMob, you can edit Uploving, it go back to you. So here we just edited Uploving as an example uh, because it's more easy. So you can add Uploving after you create in your account, you just uh, create an, an ad banner and you start copy and paste your uh, IDs right here. So uh, for ad, ad banner, you passed your ID right here uh, for your uh, interstitial. For example, you go to sidebar, you go to string, and you go to interstitial ID, and you change your interstitial ID right here. To change your SDK, you change it right here. Even your banner, you can change it right here. And app name, you can change your app name right here. So the source code, guys, it's very simple, very easy. You, you don't need to do anything. Just uh, change the necessary stuff like your IDs form and start monetizing and the design of your splash screen and you edit your uh, website link so you can convert your website into Android app with just one click. Also, if you don't know how to change your icon, simply you go to manifest and you go to this section, drawable, and you change your logo right here. Okay, so it's very simple, very easy. You don't need to do anything so all you have to do you click here and you browser your icon after you pasted your icon in, in drawable uh, folder and you can change your icon so it's very simple also guys how you can get this code i will leave the, the code link in the description you simply go to our website cheap digital products dot xyz and you go to projects android studio after you open it you find a lot of android projects that we have you go to turn your website into android app and you can see guys you can get the full source code with full functions with just 12 dollars and that's very cheap because if you go to any uh, freelancer is going to be expensive for you or even if we say you go to all these websites like uh, app my sites to convert your website into android app it's not going to give you all functions and uh, uh, possibility that you want to change so in our source code you can change everything that you wish as matching of your idea and one more thing so Let's say, for example, same website need to upload a file. So let's say, guys, your website need to upload the files. And most of the people who 
start converting the website into Android app, they're getting this problem. But in this source code, we almost covering everything and we solve all technical coding problems. So you don't need to think about this. So for example, if your website needs uploading any kind of the file, when someone click upload the file, he's going to give him access into Android device and it's going to allow the user to upload the file. Also, if your website need to access into the camera, so the user can easier access to the camera and uh, get picture or video and upload it into your file. So we're covering everything inside this source code. So you don't need to worry about this. So all you have to need, all you have to do, as we say, make the simple changements inside this source code. And it will link here for your website and change the splash splash screen change the package name and your icon and you have and the, the ids for your uh, advertisements so you are ready to go and you can start uploading your app play store and start get more customers and traffic and start monetizing your app and that's it so guys as we say if you want to get the code with the full functions and everything, all you have to go uh, to our website, cheapdigitalproduct.xyz. I will leave the link on the description. You can simply get the code and start using it.